Uh, Rob Anderson, Clean Power Wash. Uh, again, on a long drive, so doing a couple videos here. Uh, somebody's turning in front of me. Hold on one second. But, all right. So, what I wanted to do was, um, I know I've talked about kind of doing charity cleanings and things. Um, you know, years ago I would do a free wash, and then I started doing just gift certificates for a XYZ amount off of a job. Um, and I think this is easier said than done, uh, or easier for somebody with, you know, making a decent amount of money that doing this, um, to be in this position, but, um, understand how to, how to leverage a lot of that too. You know, you don't want to just give a free house wash, go out, clean it. You know, the, the time I did it, I don't know, four or five years ago, or whenever it was, it was kind of awkward, you know? I was out there and, and quite frankly didn't know as much as I do now. Um, could have done a better job. Um, and definitely now what I know with social media, there's so much stuff that you can do to leverage that into one, at the very least, goodwill. You know, it doesn't always have to turn into, well, I made money by giving this away for free. You know, it certainly helps with the taxes too, but. Uh, for pretty much every fundraiser benefit auction in town this year that I'm, you know, aware of, I'm donating a free house wash. Uh, basically, it's going to be valued up to $750, um, which would cover the vast majority of houses. Um, for those ones that are ginormous and would be a four-figure job, um, that kind of covers me a little bit there, but... Uh, probably 99% of the other jobs that you'd actually get called on that somebody would have bid for a free house wash on um, are going to fall in that 750 and below. And then we're also going to do a separate coupon um, or gift certificate for a free gutter cleaning. Um, you know, so that, that's going to cover, um, you know, a, one, a good bit of write-offs, but two, it's also going to give me that, that capability to get in front of other customers. Um, you know, when we do that, we actually give the organization that's doing the auction, um, give them one of those signed gift certificates for it, and then we're going to actually have it on one of our um, lawn signs. So we've got a gutter cleaning sign, we'll put that on there, and then we've got a house wash sign and a roof wash and all that. Um, I'm not going to do a free roof wash just because, one, there's definitely a lot more cost involved with that than with an actual house wash. Um, and two, because I think that's something that really should be paid for. Um, with the gutter cleaning and the, the house wash, that's kind of straightforward. But with, with the signs, though, the nice thing there is that then that's further branding. So these people go around, they may not bid on it. Um, I do have a, a pretty cool, or at least I like to think my clean power wash uh, Maryland theme sign. Um, it is pretty hard to forget. Um, so then that brands my company so that when anybody comes out, they see my company um, signs in the neighborhood um, that will trigger the fact that, oh, okay, that's that company. You know, the more time somebody sees your company, sees your brand, sees your image or whatever it may be, each time they see that, that puts you up, up, up um, to get a better reputation, better perception in their mind. You know, at some point, people have to, you know, they go to maybe the phone book or they go online and search. Um, and, you know, they ask their friends who they recommend. Well, one, hopefully you got your friends, you know, the, these people's friends that, that are recommending you. Um, but two, if, you know, if most times you'll have, you know, probably three or four different companies that are being recommended in those Facebook posts. You want yours to stand out as something that they're also saying, oh, okay, well, Here's these three or four companies, and hey, I remember that one. Um, you know, it, it's all about, as a lot of people have talked about, top of mind awareness. You know, you want, when this customer is finally in this, you know, position to make a purchasing decision, that your name, your company, has been branded enough that they already know, hey, let me look for this company. You know, they're looking for you, or if they're looking the Google power washers and they see your name, they see again that consistent branding and logo and inf information stuff there that that helps them make that decision to at the very least give you a call to get, get an estimate done. 
Um, again, it, it also, I've gotten a lot of work off of um, doing these benefit auctions from the people that run them. Um, because again, it, it's, you know, paying it forward. Okay, we've done something good to help your cause. Um, they obviously understand that your business is a for-profit business, just like everybody else that donated stuff. Um, and so they're, that, again, that gives them a reason to try and help you, um, you know, to, to give you that opportunity to earn their business. Um, you know, we've done stuff for Little League Fields, and I think I ended up cleaning for three or four of the, the people that run the league or that are on the board or whatever um, for that group. So, um, again, that, that's just my two cents on it. And, and again, when you're, that's your sole income and you're making twenty or $30,000 a year, um, you know, maybe you don't give away a house wash for every single auction. You know, you can't afford to do that, you know, 10 times. Um, I've, I've got a pretty, I'll say I've got an ambitious goal um, this year to do um, basically about, my, my goal is to do $250,000 to $300,000 in sales this year and I want to do about $30,000 worth um, in donated work, free work, charity, spontaneous cleanings, whatever. Um, it, it, it's kind of crazy to realize that um, that's actually possible. Um, you know, in the past, that's what I would do a year. Uh, and that's, I'm excited about that. I, I want to, I haven't really figured out how I want to promote it. Um, or if I want to more than just kind of doing the, the random cleaning things like signs, some buildings that we've done some work for. Um, we do always do free work for our church and for the school that my kids go to. So, uh, anyways, um, I know it kind of rambled off. I rambled on a little bit there and um, sorry for not looking at the camera, whatever, but have a great day guys. Thanks.